LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys. Notice, many times, laptop manufacturers produce keyboards that look the same on the outside, but have different retainer clips underneath the keys. To help you find the correct repair video for your keyboard, we've created a searchable database. Simply go to LaptopKey.com, enter your laptop brand and model number, Scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on View Videos. A list of all compatible videos will appear. Select the retainer clip model that matches your keyboard. That's all. You're now ready to repair your laptop keyboard. For this keyboard, we will be showing removal and replacement of the Enter key, apostrophe and quotation, and the top row keys for this example, print screen. In order to remove the keys, you will want to use either a spudger or a small flathead screwdriver of your choosing. To begin removing the Enter key, simply insert underneath the key and run the tool around the edge gently until you feel some give. You may notice the clips pop off alongside. If you need to remove the clips separately, simply unhook from the sides with a gentle push, and they come right out. Let's repeat this process for the top row key. Again, simply push on this side, and it comes right out. To replace the shift key, we will simply take the clips and align them such that the notch on the outside is facing upward. And there are four small holes on each side of the center piece. These can be attached by lining up and hooking in with your tool. Similarly for the opposite side, line up, push, hook in and then replace your rubber cup, if necessary, directly in the center. For the metal arm, on the shift key, you want to make sure that it is aligned with the very top edge hooks. Insert one side, followed by the other, fold down with firm presses, and the key is functional again. Next, we will repeat the process for the standard size keys. Simply take your clip with the notch on the outside facing upward, align with the holes to hook in, the same for the opposite side. Replace your rubber cap, if necessary, directly in the center. Take the key, place on top with a firm press, and the key is functional again. We will continue with the top row keys, which will attach in the same way with the notch on the clips facing upward and outward. Simply line up with the holes. And repeat for the opposite side.
take your key, place on top, firm press, and the key is functional again.